Okay, this short video tutorial is going to show you how to install and configure WordFence security plugin. Now, if you've picked up one of my uh, clones, then WordFence is more than likely already installed and configured. Uh, if you haven't, then uh, we're simply going to uh, come over here to plugins, click on add new, and then do a search for WordFence. We already have this in our browser. We're going to do a search plugins. It's going to take us out to all the plugins. We can install WordFences right at the top. I'm going to click on install now. This is just like installing any other plugin in your, uh, on your site. We're going to activate the plugin. And then we're going to get this pop up in the uh, left hand sidebar once it's activated, uh, showing us that uh, we want to get alerted. Enter your email here. I don't join their list so that's uh, you know and you can do a start tour so it'll it'll tour you through uh, WordFence. WordFence is extremely easy to configure. We're going to come over here to WordFence. I'm going to go to options and now this is the way that I configure it. If you decide to configure it a different way then that's strictly up to you. The first thing I do is I put in an email where I get my alerts. Now, in more cases than not, this is the email for the site I'm, I'm putting it on. So I get my alerts across the regular email for the site. So if my, uh, in this case, it's aocclonemaster.com, I would do support at aocclonemaster.com. If you have a regular email that you use or your primary email, you can certainly put that in there. Every time you get a security alert, it's going to be sent to that email. Now the way that I configure this is uh, all these are checked by default. I check this uh, alert me when a non-admin user signs in. Okay, so I click, I check that, and then uh, there is a paid uh, membership uh, part of uh, WordFence. You can pay for it. It's by seat, so it's uh, every single domain you have to pay for it. The free version works just fine. Uh, but if you want to get uh, more intense security on your site, you can certainly pay for it. I don't think it's that expensive, uh, but you'll need to uh, check or click on this paid members only. It'll take you out to the WordPress uh, site where you can uh, gather more information on the paid version. So I'm going to click on the scan themes and scan uh, repository for changes. I don't click on any of these scan files outside my WordPress installation. I check this because I want to know about fake Google uh, crawlers. And then uh, when it breaks a rule, instead of just a five minute lockout, I lock them out for uh, 30 days or, or one month. Okay, now for the login security options, log out or lock out after how many failed logins? I, I put five. So both of these numbers are small. Lock out uh, after how many forgot password attempts? Five. I don't want someone hammering on my site to try to figure out what the passwords are. So I make it a short period of time so that way if they mess up, uh, if it's a bot and it just keeps hammering to try to get access, then they automatically get locked out. If it's a customer and they just can't figure out what their password is, of course they get locked out. They'll send me a support email. I'll have to go back in and unlock them. Uh, that happens rarely. But you are going to find people that forget their passwords or forget how to log in. Or they'll try uh, stuff like they'll go to uh, WP Admin and try to log in uh, using WP Login PHP and use the, the password Admin. Well, immediately when they use Admin, they get locked out. So, you know, they're either trying to get in and, you know, they're, they're not nefarious. Or they are trying to break into your, your blog. And they could be members. I've had members to try to break, break in and then spread my stuff around to Black Hat sites. So, you know, I just I want to just be safe. That's basically it. Now, count failures over what time period? I put five minutes. So I want this over a short period of time. I don't want to have this spread out over 30 minutes or so. And then the amount of time a user is locked out, I want the maximum time, which is 60 days. Now, th when I check this box right here, immediately lock out invalid usernames. This is a great function because if people try to log in using admin, support, administrator, the usual things that the botnet has, has uh, essentially set up in their bots, they immediately get locked out. So they don't get access to your site. And remember, you get an email on this so you can come back in and you can unlock them if you'd like. Come down to the bottom, click on Save Changes. And that is it. That's all you have to do to configure this. And then when we come in here to blocked IPs, 
Uh, this will show us all the IPs that are blocked. This will show us that uh, IPs that are locked out from login. And you can clear these. You can clear all the blocked IPs. You can clear all the locked out IP addresses. So uh, it's real easy to, um, to lock out nefarious traffic, uh, bots, and people that want to do harm to your blog. Uh, this uh, Using the combination of WordFence and uh, better WP security, you pretty much have hardened your site as much as you can. Now, there are some other things to do, of course, and I cover that in my uh, WordPress security courses. But just by adding these two free plugins, 99.9% .9 of the, the nefarious traffic that tries to get access to your site will fail. Okay, so there's, they're just not going to be able to get access. They're, they're going to get locked out. They're going to become frustrated, especially in the botnet. They're going to get locked out for 60 days. They will not return. They'll basically wipe out your your uh, your site, take it off their list because they're they're finding that uh, it's just a waste of time for them to try to hack in because they're not going to get access. Okay, so hopefully uh, this uh, this short little video tutorial is uh, uh, shows you exactly how to con uh, to install and configure WordFence. I appreciate you taking time out of your day to watch this video.